start teaching the wave poles right away. And I do that by threading the dog through the wave poles. Now, when I do this, I always do it the same way, meaning we're always gonna enter this gate this way. We're not gonna go around this way, we're gonna enter this way. And when the dog's going away from me, I'll say weave and then here as it should be coming towards me. So I use the leash for direction. Remember your leash is also called the lead and that's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna lead the dog through the weave poles and over a period of time, muscle memory takes over and the dog learns how to do this. This is the best way to do it. Don't do it the food trainer's way. It's ri ridiculous, it takes forever. Here, weave, here, weave, here, weave. Good, good girl. Now, one thing that I will say, I have uh, done this with her three or four times and she's really picking it up. Same thing down here. We're only gonna go through this gate this way. We're never gonna go around this way and that's how it's gonna be from now on. Weave, no, weave, here, weave, here, weave, here. Do you see how she balked? But I used the leash and made sure that she did it right. When you start doing this, your dog will do this. They'll want, don't want to go through it or they start going through it and stop. Just make sure that the dog finishes out and that's it. Now we're going to do it one more time, maybe two more times and then that's it for right now. We here, we here, we. Good girl, that was real good. Give me one more time. Come here, heel. Okay, weave, here, weave, here, weave, here. Sit. That was awesome. That was really good. She's picking this up a few more days. Um, Destiny's going to be doing it with um, with baby. Baby's just going to get this down. She's getting everything down. It's a very, very good job.